Zuzi, and like so many first-generation Americans, I grew up feeling stuck between two worlds. Born in New Jersey into a big Cuban family, I was immersed in Espanol, café con leche, pastelitos, and all things Cuban. But the closest I ever got to Cuba was Miami. And that's just how things were. On December 17, 2014, the conversation began to change. Immediately begin discussions with Cuba to reestablish diplomatic relations that have been severed since January of 1961. Today, the whole world is excited about Cuba, but it remains a complicated issue for many. I'm on a journey to better understand the past, present, and the future of that magical island just 90 miles away. When I think of Cubans, I always think of us as laughing and being loud and being, you know, raucous. El sabio de la familia. <laughs> o oh, el loco de la familia. <laughs> oh, you're one of those Miami Cubans. And that's when I was like, I'm not gonna hear that again. I'm done with that line. I was conceived in Spain and it's true, born in Puerto Rico and it's true, raised in Miami and it's true, but I'm Cuban. Like this idea of like, so wait, you could be black and Cuban at the same time? How is that possible? <laughs> like, it's not that hard. <laughs> it's really very doable. There are a lot of black people who are Cubans. Craving Cuba is a film about the Cuban American experience. The more people come to this amazing country for opportunity, for political asylum, for many other reasons, the more their children and their children's children are gonna wanna know, well, yeah, I'm American, of course, but how about this other part of me? Where does it come from? It's, it's my own curiosity to, to discover, to honor, and to navigate through complicated waters. However, for the sense of pride of what my grandparents went through, we wouldn't disrespect them. But hopefully one of these days we'll be able to go visit that island. Uh, try to put aside, if you can, uh, that pain, which is rightfully yours, and visit Cuba and see Cuba today. You can travel to Cuba responsibly. But if you're gonna travel, oh, I just, I just wanna go before it changes. Come on, you're, you're kind of being a dick, right? I mean, are we not allowed to say a bad word? No.